Gordon and I have been involved with uh, various pieces of music over the last decade or so. Hundred years or so. Hundred years. And uh, so this, I mean, we're very aware of the great work that PRSF do and this project uh, to do with the Olympics came up. So we, we met up and had a chat about how can we link in this remote part of the world to what's going, going to be going on in London next year. Communication was the thing that kind of came to the, the surface. And then, and then we thought of this, this place. I remembered, I'd never been here before, but I remember my father telling me there was a, the first ever submarine uh, telecommunications telephone cable went from Oban to Newfoundland in Canada. We're about 150, 200 metres maybe into the rock um, where they blasted to make room for the, 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 the electrical equipment and the, the generators and the fans and to power the, 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 the signal through this cable. The cable, that one, was famous for carrying the hotline between Washington and Moscow and it's quite easy to imagine the the electronic voices of Kennedy and Khrushchev talking to each other during the Cuban Missile Crisis. Yeah. Maybe. Possibly. Well, well, so far a lot of the music has been, has, has been quite slow and drawn out and I think that is directly influenced by the, the noise in these chambers. I'm looking forward to um, immersing myself fully in, in writing this, in this music. It's, it's, always, it's always a bit of a journey of self-belief and discovery from nothing. All of a sudden there's uh, a, a big piece of music, a, a huge noise that didn't ever exist before. I record and play days worth of music and go through it and find the bits that I uh, think are semi-golden and then I, I, I arrange it using a, a program called Sibelius. I've written three or four uh, themes which I'm really happy with and arranged them to a certain degree but it's still I'm still drawing inspiration, though the backbone of it is, is Scottish music. It's, it's, uh, it has a kind of modern slant which takes in influences from jazz and lots of other different types of music. I mean, when you're faced with an almost blank canvas, it's quite, it can be quite terrifying. But I've done it quite a few times before, so I, I know that's just part of the process. And I think if it was all very easy, then it wouldn't be as exciting. <laughs>